Well, Harrison County beach vendors are calling it bad timing. Typically, the beaches are packed on this 4th of July holiday. But with a lot of dead fish continuing to wash up, vendors worry the stench just might keep people away. Daniel Thomas reports. As they do ahead of any big holiday weekend, Harrison County sand beach crews are cutting the grass and picking up trash. But this 4th of July, crews have the added job of cleaning up the aftermath of a fish jubilee. On Wednesday, I could smell the strong odor of dead fish while walking on some portions of the Biloxi Beach. Beach vendors assured me the smell was far more tolerable than it had been over the last few days. My guys came in and they said there was about you know, 15 feet of just straight fish floating out in the water. When all of our customers saw that, they kind of, they all decided to leave. Uh, it smelled pretty bad. Your, you could, your eyes were burning if you were down here. All day, sand beach crews traveled up and down the coastline, picking up stingrays as quickly as they could. But the problem is that workers need them to first wash ashore. Yeah, we're doing all we can down here to help out with uh, the crews that are down here. And we've walked around and picked up as much as we can by hand. Uh, the machines can only get so much, you know. They can't really go too much in the water where a lot of it's at. Beach vendors say Wednesday's crowds were smaller than the typical day before Independence Day, and they're concerned about how business will be on Thursday. If the smell continues, we might have, you know, way less customers that we could have right now. The smell has definitely gotten better since yesterday. Todd helped out taking a lot of the fish away from the beach. In Biloxi, Danielle Thomas, WLOX News. Experts say the fish kills are caused by a combination of warm water and low oxygen levels along with red tide algae blooms.